Two shops, two pairs of fucking boots. I mean, come on. We come in and we got Kim's rear end fixed, didn't we, babe? Bend over and show them your rear end we got fixed. Exactly. It's been blowing out a bit lately. Well, I don't know why, but it's just, you know. Because she hasn't got one, has she? If she hasn't got it, she wants it, I can tell you. What, did you get worried? <laughs> you come a running, didn't you? It's a love net. I'm so happy. I'm fucking on holidays, babe. Look at me. And this is the kids' room. Sorry, kids. I wish you were here. <laughs> what do you reckon, babe? Is this little fucking beauty right here? It's easier getting rid of you than the fucking moth. Let's get out. We can leave this city. Let's drive to the open air. Yeah, the countryside is so pretty With the wind blowing in your hair We can look back someday Baby, don't you understand That we only get one life I wanna make it count, honey Come on now and take my hand Take a good morning to everyone today how are we all? We're still on holidays, aren't we, babe? We are. Yeah, we are. And we're going to make our way down. We're just leaving Newry today. <laughs> Newry because it's easier to say, isn't it? Newry Utah. Newry Utah. Yeah. Um, we're heading down towards Adelaide Way today because we're going to get a new rear wheel put on Kim's bike. New tyre. See if we can do something about that arse end. Yes. <laughs> <Long gone. laughs> uh, Met that one guy years ago. Yeah, oh well, not to worry, babe. She's cool, babe. I still love you. I was about to say, I still love me. Yeah, <laughs> that's the main thing. Okay, guys, so she's been a straight run all the way through, hasn't it, babe? Sure has. So you've been a 110, just put the cruise control on, sit back and relax. Starting to come into a bit of traffic now. We're probably about 13 k's away from our destination and getting closer to the city, as you can see. The closer you get to the city, the crazier people are. Yes, they go weave in and out, don't they, babe? Sure do. I've got to, I've got to say to Kim, get your city head on. Be forceful. I get tired just looking at them. <laughs> The blood pressure goes up when we're in cities, doesn't it, babe? Yeah, you get so many dickheads in the cities. You have reached your destination. This is here, the tyre fitting specialists. So we had to get a new rear tyre for Kim's bike. We knew that when we left Tassie at some stage we would. So I reached out on Facebook to see where the best place was in Adelaide to get one. And they told me, GC Motorcycles. Thank you to that follower who commented on that because they looked after us. You ready? Yep. Hey, Kimmy's just got her a new tire put on. Not a bad mural, is it, on the side of the building, guys? Okay, so here we are, we're at Bike Works South Australia. Just come from Harley Heaven. Two shops, two pairs of fucking boots. I mean, come on. Two shops, two pairs of boots, babe. Riding boots, babe. Yeah, they're riding boots, she reckons riding boots. How many fucking feet has she got? So cheap. So these bags have gone from being rather empty to rather fucking full. Are they <laughs> not, what, babe? It's what happens when you come to the big city. You go shopping. Uh, you go <laughs> shopping. She did get a bargain, though. Bloody oath. She did get a bargain on both pairs. And just so happened, they were the only pairs that were in my size anyway. Yes. <laughs> Must have meant to be. Okay, we're out of here before she goes fucking buy anything more. We're not stopping at any more shops. Well, I did try another pair on I was going to buy, but... Yeah, those other long boots would have been nice, but I could get me foot. Yeah. Foot in them. That's a good thing. <laughs> Could have ended up with two pair then. No, you wouldn't have. Uh, I would have told you to choose. I would have been torn then. This is one thing we don't have to put up with in Tassie, in the babe. Sure is. Bloody trains. Just missed one back down the road there. Now we got this one. 
It's only a small one. <laughs> I was waiting for something huge. Jesus. Very pretty streets around Adelaide, aren't in there? Yeah. We are on the way out of Adelaide at the moment. We're going to we're heading up towards Manham now. We've done our business in Adelaide, haven't we, Bob? Sure yeah, have. Yeah, Bob, I know. You wanted to go there, so now Someone, I'm going to you. Someone's going to have to chuck out some makeup and everything to be able to take these boots home. Not going to happen. Yeah. The mule here, he'll carry everything. Don't worry, Bob. Yeah, you're a good mule. Everyone likes a nice tunnel, don't they? Yeah, no, she's red bobbing back there. Typical in it, eh? Okay, so we've just pulled into Menham Servo. Menham Town's just around the corner now. I've had Kim scrubbing for the last five, ten minutes on my bike because I went through a swarm of I don't know what it was, <laughs> but it fucking absolutely covered me windscreen and everything else, front of the bike and that. It, and most of it missed Kim, so I think I might have shielded her. You did? <laughs> yeah. Thanks. They were um, sticky it, things. All me fucking levers were sticky. Everything was fucking sticky. Even here. You've done a good job, Bob. They're even there, aren't they? Oh, yellow shit. Might have been bloody honeybees. I don't know. <laughs> it was sticky, though. Yeah, okay, I'll meet sticky. you downtown. Yeah. <laughs> you said the town's just down yeah. there. <laughs> you didn't do me grips, or did you? Yeah, I did. Oh. And I wiped them with the towel as well. Oh, did you? Oh, yeah. ooh, I'll be spoiled. You yeah. Because hey, cool. you've brought so fucking much today. <laughs> Not going there. <laughs> Let's just say I'm glad I had my visor down when we hit. Goodness, yeah. You wouldn't want an open face, would you? No, oh, fuck no. There's the Murray River, guys. And this is the main street, guys. Manham is located on the banks of the Murray River, 81 kilometres east of Adelaide. Historically an important river port, today Manham is a pleasant holiday town on the Murray River with extensive parks and numerous river-based attractions. It caters for a variety of water activities, paddle steam cruises, kayaking, adventures, wildlife sanctuaries, and there is both fishing and bird watching. The main attraction is to get out on the river and marvel at the beauty of the vast waterway. So we continued on down through the main street and at the top of town is a caravan park, the Breeze Caravan Park. This here is a fantastic little caravan park with facilities right on the waterfront of the Murray River. Now, no, keep going. 34, 35, this one here, babe. Oh, we've got lovely parking, so that's good. Fucking turn the bikes around in here. Bloody earth you can, as long as no one parks beside us. Oh, we got a deck. Yep. Here we are, we're again, we're here, we're here, we're here. Stop panicking, guys, we got here today, here we are. And where is here? Here is in a beautiful surround, and look at this. Look at this, starts of M. We're in Manham, aren't we, tonight? Yes. We're in Manham for a couple of nights, actually. That's because we like the place and we can do it. We're on holidays, aren't we? Rusty's happy, there's plenty of birds around. Plenty of birds around. We're in a wildlife sanctuary at the moment. The wrong sort of birds, but it doesn't matter. Well, we had a great ride today, didn't we? Up through the Adelaide Hills. We left... Um, the Barossa Valley. The Barossa Valley. We come in and we got Kim's rear end fixed, didn't we, babe? Bend over and show them your rear end we got fixed. It's out there. It's out there. We got Kim's rear end on the bike fixed. So I'll just take you out and I'll show you. Look, I'll show you. Won't be long. Look, this is our, this is our bungalow for the night. This here, this here is all our car parking spot, okay? So there's the bikes. So Kim's got a new rear end, see? Now, see, there's Kim. Can you see it, guys? Now, if it's only that fucking simple to get the rear end fixed like that, I mean, it's been blowing out a bit lately. I don't know why, but it's just, you know, we've got that one fixed. All we've got to do now 
Get that one fixed. Yeah, oh, yeah, nah, look at her. Look. Look. Yeah, nah. See, old, old Rusty will admit, Rusty made a mistake today. Rusty said, right, we're going down in that lane, we're getting this tyre put on the bike, on the rear end of her bike, right? So that's fine. And then Rusty said, we'll go to the two Harley shops, then we'll make our way up to Mellon. Well, both Harley shops yielded fucking boots. There's one pair. And I'll, I'll, I'll fucking show you the other. Look, poor old Rusty's boots fallen off him nearly. And then, there's the other fucking pair. Look here. Two brand new pairs of boots that he brought today. Although, in saying that, they cost 50 bucks each. So, I don't know if you can count, that's 100 bucks for two pairs. But, proper retail price would have been between 4 4 50 So, I suppose it's a bargain, isn't it? Yeah, it is. What it's do you reckon? It's bloody windy. Not windy, Rosie's just got nothing to fucking wear. Well, not my fault, they were my perfect size. And the worst thing is, she, oh no, sorry, no, I like, Rusty did get some. Oh yeah. Rusty got his new beaut stubby holder. With an opener on it? Yeah. Yes. It's got a fucking opening on it. Opener on it, see, see, thank, there it is. And Kim's already trying to steal my bottle opener. <laughs> because she hasn't got one, has she? If she hasn't got it, she wants it, I can tell you. Right out. so this is our abode for the night, guys. Well, I'll tell you what, this is a little bit big for us. Even if we had the fucking kids on holidays, we wouldn't find them here, would we, babe? It's a bit fancy for us. Table, chairs, everything. Look, Rusty's already decorated and put that up there. See that? <laughs> yeah. Rusty's good at decorating, isn't he, eh? <laughs> oh, they, well, what did you think it was? What, did you get worried? <laughs> <laughs> you come a running, didn't you? Yeah, so there's our couch and full kitchen tonight. So we're tossing up. Who's cooking tonight? The tosser. <laughs> Fuck, I'm not cooking. Man, we'll get in the street, get to. All right, so this is the um, the bathroom. There's your fucking shower. There. Yeah, all that, guys. It's a fucking mess. We've already used it. Here's the old love nest. What's wrong? What? It's a love net. So oh, fucking on holidays, babe. Look at me. Do I not look smiley? Maybe I can tell in the bedroom. So, as soon as I put Kim to bed tonight, on that side, right there, I'll sit a bottle. <laughs> and she'll be a fucking sleep in about 10 minutes. <laughs> Wait, come on, get your boots. Come on, get out of the way, girl. <laughs> yeah, okay. So. And this is the kids' room. Sorry, kids. I wish you were here. <laughs> what, what do you reckon, babe? Do you wish the kids were here with us? Yeah, sorry. Yeah, we've only got room for four, but if we topped yeah. and tailed, we could probably fit seven. This is where you would have been sleeping. This is where... Have a look, guys. Where you would have been sleeping. And now... There seems uh, to be all too many rules. Though. Too many rules here. Warnings and things. Uh, so, one thing Rusty is happy with, though. One thing I really am happy with is this little fucking beauty right here. That's a full-size refrigerator for full-size people, isn't it, babe? Yep. I really do like that. I don't know what's in here. Oh, oh, fancy oh, stuff. Oh, look at this. Should have brought our wine down from the Barossa Valley. We yes. shouldn't have fucking drank it all, should we? Yeah. Hey, guys, got to go. We've got to go down the street. Yeah, we've got to work out what's for time. Ah, I am not sleeping in this room. Why? There's a moth in here. It's only a little moth. You need to get rid of it. <laughs> it's easier getting rid of you than the <laughs> fucking moth. <laughs> Look, she's scared of a little moth, guys. Look. Oh, moth on our curtain. Do you want him? No, 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 no. I'll get him. No. Mate, where are you? Sweetie. Oh, I'll let him go. There you go. Fly away, little baby. There you go. Yep, he's up in the tree. He's up in the gum tree. <laughs> hey, guys. They should be running around all fucking night now looking for mobs. Hey, guys, gotta go. And uh, we'll catch you tomorrow. See you, guys. Bye.
<laughs> okay, here we are. We've got a beautiful morning. Watch out, you're going to get run over, babe. Yep. <laughs> We've got a beautiful morning here at Manham, haven't we, babe? Yeah. It's about 25 degrees today. And here is our caravan park. We're in a cabin up behind us there. But we're going to take you down by the water's edge and show you what we've got here in Manham. There we go. Look, that's not Murray, but that's a lagoon off the Murray, isn't it, sweetie? Yeah. What are you hiding behind me for? There, look, there's Kim's little friends, aren't you? Hey, they think you got food, babe. I haven't. What are you hiding for? What are you hiding I don't for? Want they're, them to ducks. Bite me. they're ducks, man. Do they peck? They'll peck if you peck. Okay, so there it is there. Look at that. Beautiful. We are going on the Murray today, aren't we, sweetie? Yeah. In some dilapidated paddle steamer. The Mayflower. <laughs> <laughs> it actually is the Mayflower. Yeah. It's the first one that went to America. Kim Mayflower one day, I don't know when, but anyway. <laughs> it's a long walk around this caravan park. It is when you're used to riding in it, sweetie. Yep. Yeah. Look at this, look at this. Just take a look at it, guys. Beautiful Manham Street. We've got two but... ferries operating today. Woohoo! Must be a busy day. Must be a busy day, eh? What is today? Tuesday. Today is Tuesday. And people will be pleased to know that we've only got a little over a week to go. Now, what are you saying like that for? Well, people just... will be pleased to know we've done. People are loving it. I don't think so. People are at work are not loving us being on holidays. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but they'll be on holidays one day and we'll be at work, won't we? Yeah, and we'll still like them being on holidays. Has someone told you they don't like you being on holidays? I don't know. Uh, OK. Um, this is the visitor information centre we're coming up to. Look at this COVID mess. This is the COVID exterminator. Someone's made it. Look at that. I think you might be able to see that there. It is a gabble of everything in the bay, bay. Price on application. You can buy it. You can buy it if you want. Look at that. Look at that. That's our bottle shop there, isn't it, sweetie? Yeah. Very important place in Manham, isn't it? Yep. Very important. Yep. Why? Because it has our legendary liquor. <laughs> legendary. Well, there you go, eh? It is. A, there's not a cloud in the sky, guys. Look. Look. Oh, I'm not lying, is, am I, babe? No, it's, uh, this one time he's not. What time was I lying? Uh, uh, I don't even know you anymore, Russ. Oh, yeah, no, that's true. Uh, the Arch, Lover's Arch. Somewhere. Did you look it up? I didn't. The Lover's Arch? Did you look the Lover's I Arch up? I want to, in once in my life, believe you without Googling something. <laughs> and this is it. <laughs> so we're going to go into the Rustic Country Cafe. Why are we going in there, babe? Because it's Russ. Rustic. Rustic. It's like me, I'm rustic, aren't it's I? That's how we choose things. Yeah. So what are you having for a brekkie, babe? Mum, I'm not sure. I'm just having what you have. Because <laughs> I couldn't you're remember. Having, you're having a Turkish bread, aren't you? Yeah, with eggs and bacon. And bacon, yeah. And a coffee. For yeah. 12 bucks, aren't you? Yeah. She'll oh. probably eat mine as well, but that's the same. I will not. <laughs> yeah. So this is the cafe. Right here. Very nice people. Very nice service and friendly, yeah. weren't they? Yeah, very. Yes, very nice. Yeah. What do you got? Um, bacon and egg Turkish bread. Is it? Yeah. yeah it looks same lovely. as you? Yeah, same as me, actually. Oh, did we ask for sauce? No, nah, we didn't. Okay. Did right. 12 bucks. That's not bad value, is it? I'm going to ask. Where are you going? Get some barbecue sauce. Oh, she's going to annoy him. Yeah. Okay, so that was a very nice breakfast, wasn't it? Yeah. And, um, very nice people there, wonder Bob. Oh yeah, go there and, for uh, sure. What is it? Rustic Country Cafe, yes. My word, make sure you go there. Check it out. Don't worry about good. Don't worry about the bigger. Fuck, big... I've seen your wedding dress, babe. Look! Oh. Look! <laughs> that would suit you down uh, to the ground, sweet. If I had to pick, I'd pick this one here. Which one? That one, would yeah, you? Yeah. Yep. Okay. Yeah. Is that your style? Oh yeah, yeah. Okay. Bohemian fantasy. Uh -huh. Well, dude, well, that sounds good to me. Fantasy. <laughs> you sure you're saying it? Oh, it's whips and chains. All the yeah, bits. whips and chains and everything. Mm -hmm. It's made for Kimmy Russ adventures. <laughs> Are you uh, leaving me to cross the road by myself? Yeah, well, come on. Those that snooze lose. <laughs> uh, we're going down to the foreshore. Just to have a bit of a bow peak, guys. 
Oh, what a beautiful I tell you. Oh, there's people down here jogging and everything. I oh, know, they're going to wear us out, aren't they? The hell? <laughs> <laughs> it's a bit of a problem, isn't it? It's eh? early in the morning. We get tired when we see people exercising and jogging. Yeah, so we do. We'll probably end up back in bed before we get on the paddle steamer. <laughs> we'll miss the paddle steam <laughs> right at one o'clock. Yeah. Isn't it beautiful, eh? Look at this. When you just love to live on the banks of the Murray River. I oh, know ah, I would. I would. I would love it. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to get Russ to sell the house and everything. Just keep the bikes, buy a houseboat. Buy a houseboat? Yeah, we'll be right. Babe, you get fucking seasick. It won't be leaving the dock, babe. What, well, what's the use of buying a houseboat? We might as well, we might as well have a house up on the hill here. No, somewhere. houseboat. Oh. Um, you'll be able to rock me to sleep with my bottle. I can rock you to sleep anyway with your bottle, babe. Oh, I mean, come on, guys. Who wouldn't want the Murray River as a place to live? Hey, babe? Yeah, it's... Exciting moment. We're standing here watching Kimmy Russ adventures go past. Yeah. Give him a wave, babe. Oh my god, you would not believe, babe. Wave! Hi. Wave, it's Kimmy Russ adventures on shore over there. Look at him. Oh they're waving. <laughs> Hi. G'day! Have Hi. a good trip, guys. I oh, know I keep showing you, but oh Russ, he loves the Murray River. I don't know why. It's just historic it's all the freight used to go through the Murray it's just what do you call it babe it's awe inspiring inspiring historical no, it's awe inspiring I reckon the yeah. Murray River it really is yeah just love it I could live on it I tell you see sell the house everything oh, and you the... want to coop yourself up in a boat on the fucking wharf I'd love it oh Jesus we can take off up the Murray anytime we want oh yes yes okay this is the free, um, what are you calling both? Ferry. Ferry, ferry, ferry across the Mersey? Yeah, or barge. Uh, across the Murray. Murray. Yeah, or, or barge. The barge. The boat. And as you can see, they just opera on a cable system. Pulley and cables. See like that? Lift up, away they go. Unhook. Cool, eh? And across the other side, where they've got no one waiting at the moment. Yeah. All they do is hook straight in there. Bingo. She's in, isn't she, babe? She's got... And, and off we go again. So that's the slipway. The only one on the Murray that's left with the paddle steamers. And this here is our boat. There's Mayflower. So this here is the Mayflower that we're going on in it, bud. Hey, welcome aboard, bud. I was never the one to write up a song for just anyone. I, I was always the one to find myself lost in all conversations of Cause I've always been told that things will unfold if you keep on waiting But then you came along and proved me all wrong I was 
you're so mistaken Cause you glue all the pieces back together Yeah, you, you take all my rocks